For farmers here in West Texas, the drought has been challenging enough, and now fertilizer prices are skyrocketing. KLBK's Landry Senna joining us now. Landry, how is this affecting crop production in our area? Terry, over the past year, fertilizer prices have gone up 300 percent. With one issue on top of the other, farmers aren't sure yet what crop year they're looking at. And right now, it's crunch time for especially those cotton farmers. Right now, we're so dry that um, honestly, we're not making any decisions. If you do get rainfall, you start leaching it out, you lose it, it goes too deep for the roots, stuff like that. Uh, if you get too late, then your crop doesn't have it to use and it doesn't develop correctly. It's been tricky and it's been interesting, but we, we're still continuing to talk about it and figure out how we can plan for that. Fertilizer prices now are almost double what they were this time last year, which was double what it was the year before. With the high prices that we're going to have to basically put out the same dollar amount that we've done in the last years, we're just not going to get the same quantity. And sometimes you have to adapt and try to outperform your environment. When you can't do that, you do the best you can. And because fertilizer is a part of the world market, any global event will affect the price. With natural gas being a huge component and the invasion in Ukraine affecting natural gas exports from Russia, we're, we're looking at fertilizer increases across the board. So now it's a waiting game for these West Texas farmers who depend on their crops to put food on their tables. Farmers really do want to clothe the world and they really are proud of that mission and so they're resilient here in West Texas. One thing farmers, we, we always persevere, we're optimistic, so we just get, we keep going. Plains cotton growers do say even with fertilizer at record highs right now, they're confident it'll still be a great crop year as they try to do the best with what they have.